Spanish Fort Police have connected a suspect in a recent police chase to a string of car break-ins currently under investigation. NBC 15's Corey Pippen is live at the Spanish Fort Police Department with more tonight. And Corey, police are still searching for some suspects there. Yeah, Greg, Greg, that's right. Greg, that's right. Police believe at least four men were responsible for those break-ins, which investigators say happened in multiple neighborhoods Tuesday night. So far, the only suspect in custody is 27-year-old Joshua Johnson, a Daphne resident. The arrest was made after state police say a trooper observed a black Toyota Camry speeding on the causeway just after 10 Tuesday night and tried to pull the vehicle over. Authorities say Johnson, who was the driver, refused to stop and sped into Mobile County. He was arrested after the chase ended, but three other occupants ran from the scene. During the pursuit, authorities say three weapons were thrown out of the vehicle, including an AR rifle and two shotguns. Only the shotguns were recovered. Spanish Fort Police say the firearms are connected to car break-ins earlier that night. Unlocked vehicles were the target. Groups like this are targeting this area because they know it's very common. It's it's, it's easy target for them. Uh, firearms are, are, that's what they're specifically looking for in most cases. Um, and it, it's a commodity, you know, for over on the streets. I mean, they can easily sell it. Authorities are still looking for those three other suspects. Doorbell video actually captured several homeowners encountering the suspects Tuesday night. We'll have that video and reaction from homeowners coming up tonight at 10. Reporting live in Spanish Ford, I'm Corey Pippen, NBC 15 News.